Alright, hey, what is going on, everybody? Ali here, and, uh, finally, I decided, um, after, like, a few months, I've had this interview that I, that I did with a cosplayer named, uh, Marie, uh, Cla uh I think Claude Bonnet, I think that's how you say her last name, but anyways, um, I've been holding it off for so long because of, uh, the audio and stuff, because there's so much background noise and stuff, so I got Audacity and I tried to fix it up, and honestly, I really couldn't. Um, I had to transfer the video to a different file and stuff. It was just all a hassle, but so uh, after all that, I just decided I am just gonna show the whole video just just raw, like no editing and stuff like that. I'm not gonna edit any of the video, any of like the audio or anything because I've been holding it off for like too long. So I'm just going to post it up and I'm just gonna show you guys. And uh, I just want to tell you this is my first ever. Um, cosplayer interview, my first ever interview, like, period, so, um, I am nervous, I, I am a little nervous about, uh, talking with her at the beginning and everything, but, um, overall, I had a fun time, uh, interviewing her, it's like a quick, I think, three or four minute video, but, um, anyways, it was a lot of fun for me to actually meet this girl, I, she is my favorite cosplayer of all time, and I actually got to interview her for my first cosplayer interview, interview with a cosplayer, and it was just an awesome time, so, and also, to reiterate something, there's a part where I said Marie, uh, like, a question Marie, it was because I wanted to make sure that I pronounced it right, because it could be Mary, or, like, Meryl, or something like that, so I just wanted to make sure, so I am, I know who she is, all right, so, um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy this video, it's, it's, again, it's a raw footage, I didn't edit anything, didn't edit the music, or, like, the background noise, or anything like that, so, you might not hear her as clearly, but overall, you can get what, like, she is saying in the interview, and stuff, so, um, yeah, hope you like it, peace out, peace and love. Alright, what's going on, everybody, Ali here, and I'm with, uh, cosplayer Marie, Alright, cool. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really, I don't know what to say. <laughs> I'm really excited. Um, Alright, so, I'm just gonna ask, like, two questions or something. So, um, what was your first cosplay you ever did that you were just so proud of? Oh, all started with Frost. People only know me at first that story before. I, I had no idea what Frost was at that time. I was known from the public as a model. I was all the custom decorations that she made. So I had, I, I had to my friend of her friend if you want to take a picture or something else than want to make a as usual. Oh yes. Said, yes. So I built that first costume because I was a huge Mortal Kombat fan and we did a photo shoot, the photographer released pictures on the internet and this is how I found out that dressing up as a character I had made. I found out that it was popular, that many people were doing that, that there were competitions like this. I had never heard of that before, and it was a very long moment for me at that time. So for us, I, I love Frost. that costume because everything started because of that. I found out about costume because of Frost. So I, I, I love Frost. I love Mortal Kombat and all that. It's such a fun game, but um, also, uh, I think you, you already said it, that uh, Rack, you know how long it took you and stuff, but... Yeah. How proud did you feel like after you finished it? Like I, I, I saw a picture of you at um Animax uh -huh. I think, and you got to meet the uh okay, yeah, the, the, yeah, the, the guy who, the who created guy. Monster Girls. So how did that feel and like just how proud were you of that uh cosplay? I was surprised because I was so visible being right and right that I hadn't even realized that he was one of the guests of the show. Yeah, that's so pretty was, crazy. That's pretty yes. crazy. So he came to the booth his translator because he speaks only Japanese and it was an honor for me and he seemed to be very happy too so it was like I was surprised, happy, exhausted, everything at the same time but it was the best part of my career. Yeah, I also want to tell you about like my first cosplay uh -huh. that I've ever done. Like the first serious one. Uh, a lot of my friends know about this. Uh, do you know Aang from The Last Airbender? Yeah. Avatar. Um, that was my first real cosplay, like the, the whole monk outfit, and you see like my head, the hair, shaved it all, all completely off. My first cosplay, I went all out and shaved my head, and it was just like that start. That's the thing that started off with cosplay. So yeah, it was a lot of fun. Yeah. It's a pretty crazy one for the first time too, so 
Yeah, alright, Paul. That's it for this one. Uh, like the video, comment down below, subscribe to my channel, my YouTube channel. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys later. All right, so that is the interview that I had with this wonderful lady, such down, so down to earth, so beautiful in person and everything. And she just does like everything from scratch, all of her cosplays, from Frost all the way to Ragnarok, insane, insane stuff. I was so, ha again, I was so happy to interview her for my first cosplay, um, interview with a cosplayer, um, I was just happy and uh, a little nervous, but I didn't give, I didn't really care that I was nervous and stuff. I just talked and I got like more comfortable with as the uh, whole video went on or as the whole interview went on and stuff. So, um, yeah, go check her out, her Instagram, Marie Claude uh, Bournet's, and uh, check out her website. Link is going to be in the description and everything. So, um, yeah, peace and love. Like the video if you did, comment down below on your thoughts, and subscribe to my channel for more reviews, vlogs, unboxings, live reactions, and theory discussion videos, and maybe some more cosplay interviews and stuff like that. So, gentlemen, stay classy. Ladies, stay sexy. But most importantly, everybody, you gotta stay a little nasty, alright? So, peace and love, and I will see you all later with the next video. Peace out. So gorgeous!